Alrighty. Well, I've had the Tesla for two days now, and I uh, got it, well, not even two days, but I got it yesterday afternoon and drove it around yesterday. Charged it last night, got it fully charged, and then drove it around uh, a bit today, not a ton, but, but drove it around. And it currently says it's got 67 miles left on it. And I know there's no chance that I drove uh, anywhere near 150 miles or 160 miles with it. Uh, so that's telling me that uh, I'm driving it, uh, I guess, harder than, uh, than they did when then they gave the 240 mile prediction so uh we'll have to see what my real mileage will be also i had the heat on and uh i leave the headlights on when i'm driving and all those things reduce you know use up energy and re you're going to reduce range so we'll have to do some tests to see what the actual ranges are under some of these different circumstances but uh right now i wanted to show what it's like to charge the Tesla because it's pretty interesting. Um, you can see that it's got what looks like a gas a gas uh, cover here, but when we open it, well, first of all, it lights up, and then obviously that is not anywhere you've put any gas. Uh, so over here we've got our handy charger installed in the wall uh, from Tesla. This charger takes three circuits going into it, three 30 amp circuits, which are the same things that go into the 220 volt uh, electric plug that your dryer plugs into. So basically this is like three dryers, uh, 90 amps, and it has a big cable that's very heavy and feels kind of like a gas cable. But at the end of it, instead of having a gas end, it's got this charger with a nifty locking mechanism that feels kind of like you're arming a bomb or something like that. You can see little grooves on the, um, go to close up here, you can see a little groove on the connector. And so you line up this, uh, this line right here with that dot with the groove. And then as you slide it in, you turn it so that it locks into place. And so we're gonna hear now that on and then there we go then push in push in and twist and that locks and then we've got this switch here which we push in and locks and now you can see that the light turned blue that's a good sign hear that click some more clicks that big click and then the flashing yellow which means that it is charging and we've got a yellow light up here meaning it's charging and when it's done it'll then glow green so it kind of reminds me of Knight Rider with all the uh, different colors we've got flashing but very informative then as we look down here we can see the screen and see where it says 67 miles and that it's currently charging So we'll uh, let that go for the evening, and then when I come back, it should be all charged. Oh, we also have a nice little flashing charging icon on the dash. So we, uh, we'll leave that charging, and uh, in the morning I'll come back and it should be green. And that is how you go and charge a Tesla.